Well, in this video, I get to show this shiny new symbol in the 2018 standard, which is the dynamic profile modifier. So let me first introduce it with a normal profile taunts. Here I have a hexagon shape that I want to be a basic dimensions of 120 degrees and 10 millimeter distances across there. So how much variation would you allow? That's perfect for a profile taunts. Profile within 0.3 all around. Now we know our default profile taunts is going to control both size and form. Because of the shape of the tolerance zone, you have 0.3 millimeters equidistributed. That's going to control how big, how small, and it also controls the form as well. However, because of the larger value here, you could get a shape that looks like this, and technically that's inside the tolerance zone. So what we want is to control the form of it, but I don't really care about the size. You can make a big hex, you can make a small hex, but I want it to look like a hex. So they created a new modifier called dynamic profile. It's a little delta symbol that you put behind the tolerance value. So this is a profile of 0.1 dynamic. So dynamic profile means that the distance between the two boundaries has to remain at 0.1, but these tolerance zones can grow and shrink. So that means this distance between here is variable. So you're unlocking the size requirement of profile. On a closed shape, profile taunts has to be equally distributed around there. So that would control both the size and the form. How do we control form only? That's with this modifier here. So now if a shape came out like this and you said, OK, it's just a little bit too big, well, this profile boundary for the point 0.1 can expand and say, yes, as long as this distance between them is good, then we do have a good profile. This is one of the holes that we had in our standard in 2009 and earlier, is that we didn't have a way to unlock the size requirement from a profile. And now we do in 2018. Think of this as a very similar concept to what we did in Unit 10 with a form tolerance, cylindricity. So what do we do on cylindricity? We give a bigger plus or minus for the size. You can make a big one, you can make a small one, but it's got to be cylindrical within 0.1. So the same thing here. You can have a plus or minus 0.3 on your size, but it better be a nice shape. So this profile taunts is becoming a hexagonicity or a triangleicity or a butterflyicity. You can make it any shapeicity that you want here because you're controlling the form of that feature, unlocking that size. So kind of a neat concept and not an everyday thing, but maybe for certain situations it might be helpful. Stay tuned for the next video because I have an application where this might be useful.